If I touch your chin, she can't. She stops scratching. Stop it. That's so funny. If I touch your chin, wouldn't you stop scratching? No, I love it. But you would scratch somewhere else at the same time? No, you're not. Scratch somewhere else at the same time. This is so soft. <laughs> so I know you guys are sitting there and you're thinking, do I give a shit about what Allison Raskin and Gabby Dunn do all day? What products they use, what their life looks like? Hell no! Do I care what sugar the dog does all day? Oh my god, I am intrigued! So welcome to your first ever dog lifestyle vlog. Sugar leads. An extravagant and glamorous life. I just want to say that none of these products have paid us to show them. It's kind of like a haul video. Like no one's sponsoring it, you're just like buying and showing what you bought. What's a haul video? What I just said. So first of all, you're probably wondering like how does sugar eat? From this really cool turquoise bowl. Where'd you get that? At a pet store. Cool. If, I don't think you guys can see, but it says woof. That's kind of cute. The number one thing that people want to see when they see dog lifestyle vlogs. <laughs> a thing that doesn't exist. A number one thing <laughs> is, go is on. So go, what is it? A number one thing that people want to see when they watch dog lifestyle vlogs is the harness, right? Yeah, because people harness, are really trying to get Sugar's life. I actually have two harnesses for Sugar. Oh my God, what a spoiled bee. Yeah, she's getting to be quite a biatch. <laughs> Oh, she heard you. So this is confusing to Sugar because she thinks she's going out, but you're not. So just get it through your little pea brain that we're staying here and doing your lifestyle vlog. So this was the first harness that I bought. Um, it's a knockoff Burberry. <laughs> Look how ready she is to go. <laughs> she's so ready to go. Oh my oh, god. This is the, she doesn't understand any words. The <gasps> only thing Sugar understands is like what her harness is. That is so funny. So I'll be like, let's go for a walk. Nothing. Do you want to go out? Nothing. Come, sugar. Nothing. Oh, wait. She always looked at her name. Maybe she knows her name. I've got to say that her name is Sugar and she wears this pink harness and everyone thinks she's a boy. So wow. gender binary is out the window. This flushes her ears out. Why do you need to do that? She gets ear infections. I've only had sugar for about like six or seven months. Mm -hmm. And I've been so blessed in that time to have to give her every type of medicine possible. <laughs> What's wrong with this dog? <laughs> A lot. <laughs> oh, I'm glad we're talking about this now because this dog was supposed to help you with your OCD and instead, please introduce this new product. These are the grooming wipes. Um, I use these to wipe her paws and ass whenever she comes inside. And then if we've been like out in a place where she's lied down and all, then I groom her, I like wipe down her entire body. Blink twice if you need me to take <laughs> no, you away. No, she's fine. She's so happy. Do you need me to take you out when of When I found her, she was living under a desk. This is a real mommy dearest situation. Like, are you okay? I don't understand the reference. You're just coming in contact with so much poop, which I guess furthers your theory that poop is everywhere. When I know where the poop is, I can, and like I can see it and it's clear and I can just pick up the poop and I can like clean that area, that's fine. It's the fear that I don't know where the poop is. And this is me doing the best I've ever done. This is a monkey emoticon toy that Sugar showed an interest in for about four minutes one time. No, not four minutes in a row, that would be crazy. Okay, we've seen the comments wherein people wonder if Sugar is sedated or like, you know, is alive, is a stuffed dog that we're just pretending is a real dog. She's alive. She plays. When? She's played. Let me show you my work bag for her. <laughs> oh, now this bad boy, this is an actual antler. We mm -hmm. have to wash our hands after this video. Chiggies. Is she looking? Minimal she interest. Oh, she's getting it. Ooh, she Minimal. Likes it. Come on, come on. Take the antler. These are cheesy bones. You want a cheesy bone? <laughs> you have to say it like that. You want cheesy bone? How do you want your cheesy bone? Sit. Yeah, right. When I first got sugar, I, I said I needed to get her a bed, and my sister graciously said that she would do it. She then ordered a custom dog bed that took three months to arrive. <laughs> oh, it's covered in blood. What? <laughs> it's it's covered in blood. She has like a like an open sore on her butt. It's not open. <laughs> It's been open. It's like a blood, not a blood clot. What do you call a blood clot on the outside? Blister? Kind of, yeah. And like, I think it's because she like gnawed at herself. And um, after I sent uh, extreme close-ups of it to everyone in my family, mm -hmm. and I took her to the vet, it was determined not to be a big deal. 
But I think it opened at one point, and that's the blood we're seeing on the bed. Did you tell your sister that it got on her fancy dog bed? I can't get a hold of my sister. No, now I'm like really worried that I give her a bad life. You don't give her a bad life. What was her life before you? It was worse than this. But is that a good reference point? Sure, yeah. I'd say call this an upgrade. But she, okay, once she went up for adoption, though, she would have been adopted because she's so fucking adorable. What if someone better adopted her, like, a week later? Who? Who is better? Like, Kristen Bell. You think Kristen Bell would have adopted Sugar if you hadn't? Absolutely. What we're getting here from so far from the products is that a lot of Sugar's products have to do with your own anxiety. Yeah. Okay. She's my anxiety dog.